territorial commanders. They are spiritual territorial commanders. You have nothing to pity about them. They are heavily defended. You have nothing to pity about them. They are heavily defended. Devil is in trouble. I said the devil is in trouble. I said the devil is in trouble. Prophets are spiritual territorial commanders. These are territorial commanders. They are spiritual territorial commanders. You have nothing to pity about them. They are heavily defended. You have nothing to pity about them. They are heavily defended. Devil is in trouble. I said the devil is in trouble. I said the devil is in trouble. The devil has never been troubled than these days and times. The devil is in trouble. Yeah. 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 Adu shakata ka raka taraba sukuturu Adu shakata ria kata ha Abasoturi ante shatou 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 Ishaka mota pro Azizo ketandeko baradash Waba waba ezo blokotosia Ishakaro sakero bari Jakota Brady, Eso Parada, Yekarada Bobe, Ekatu Parede, Yishakaratu Zeno, Ibare Zakona, Para, Para, Usa, Usa Kanatosia, Yeto Pekete Zelo, Yakorada Beyete Zo, Iparada Zuse, Iparada Zuse, Iparada Zuse, Iparada Zuse, Iparada Zuse, Yakorade Karada, 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 Usaba, 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 Kekoteko, Bekoteko, Balesata. Lei, Gosa Prat. Sejon de Ligo, a cruz, Goja Laman de Ligiza Bahas. Taligus, Efronigo, Undigor, Ascradistas, La Hatakida. Shalamon so prato le ongo skijo sali tradigo baho skijo la man tradiga sahata claro skijo sartligo abna hazet sazo zonjez la hangra digo verduz de frate la has la higra da hazte takuz takuz de pahatila tadigo soja salama kiza atu soja prato se hata 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 Siza Zazazino, Suja Zalahato, Kriza Parahondo, Kiza Palahando, Paruz Gojo Zalahato Kizo. Bless, bless, bless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mais je pratique sous les
Greetings, 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 saints. I hope I find you well wherever you are. My name is Apostle Emma Panda. I pray and I believe I find you majestically well in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. Greetings, 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 greetings. Where is my audio capture? Greetings, greetings, greetings. Um... Libra, Hande, Brosodi, Kashaka, Taraba. I pray and I believe. Um, greetings, greetings, saints. saints. I, hope I hope I find you well. Yeah, there's, there's been, been a hiccup, hiccup on my system, but I, but I am now back, back in order. In order. Uh, I hope I find you well wherever, wherever you are. are. I pray and I believe that, that uh, this, this moment, moment and this wonderful, this wonderful uh, um, Midnight, Midnight, we are going to actually, actually have, a, have a quality, quality time, time in the presence of the Lord. Wherever, Wherever you're connecting, you're connecting from, from, I don't know where you are connecting from right now, but I just, but want, I just to want to take this opportunity to greet you. Greet you. Wherever, Wherever you are, I just want to say greetings to you. I see um, um, Angel Grace is watching. I see, I see memory, memory is here. here. Luella, you are here. You are here. Um, many, of many of you are here. here. I just want to welcome you all in the powerful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. May the Lord bless you indeed. And in in large ter territory, I also, I also see here uh, uh, on the prophetic channel. I can see here, uh, uh, Chishoma, you are here, Ian, you are here, Peter, Peter and Kos, you are here, uh, Gloria, uh, Gloria Mafata, you are here, strategic, uh, uh, strategist, uh, you are here. Uh, connecting, uh, connecting from Malawi, Malawi. I'll, prophesy I'll prophesy very soon. Nishek, you are here, here connecting, connecting from Zambia. Tusu, you are watching, watching from South, South Africa. Africa. Uh, 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 major, major daughter, we should make prophet, prophet, we should make prophet, we should make God bless you. Uh, God, uh, God bless you. God bless you. Um, Tosa, you are saying good morning, morning, morning you are connecting from Botswana. Tabete, you are also here. You are also connecting. By the grace of God, you are connecting. I pray you are healing me well wherever you are um how shoni you are here as well god bless you 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 pam you are here patricia you are here too so you are here um gloria you are here greetings apostle midnight hour i just want to tell you something quickly about the prophetic the prophetic if you are here and you are interested in the prophetic i want you to know this and those people who are here right now who want to actually make the prophetic word to work in their lives this is the moment this is the time because sometimes we don't have time to teach you this but at this midnight hour something is about to happen maybe you're from lesotho uh king king kingdom of lesotho next door to bloomfontein um you will uh, mute something you are getting an echo interference is it still appearing is it still appearing is the echo you're also here you're also connecting um uh, by the grace of god you're connecting I um i think i think you realize the the the, the echo is is quiet isn't it the echo is quiet there were two inputs there were two inputs there were two inputs there were two audio inputs that were giving audio tabang how are you greetings apostle i need prophecy tonight definitely don't worry i'm going to do that i'm going to do that very soon <laughs> We are going to have a prophetic buffet, like I told you, I'm, I, but I want to teach you something quickly before we get into the prophetic buffet so that you will understand uh, what we are going to go through. Morning Apostle connecting from Pumalanga, that's Agnes. Um, Yurela, are you hearing me now clearly? Sunny, you are connecting from Dubai. Shianu, you are saying, please prophesy to me, man of God. I'm going to do that. Don't worry. I'm going to do that. I want to teach you how to activate the prophetic word. When the prophetic word is released, there is a way to activate the prophetic word. There is a way to activate the prophetic word. Um, Tuso, you are saying, no, there is no echo. God bless you, Tuso. Thank you very much. I was trying to listen uh, because normally when I'm doing it on my phone, uh, I think it started when, when we started the stream because my, my audio interface was not connected there. Um, you realize saying it's okay now. All right, God bless you. Thank you, people. Thank you very much. May the Lord bless you. Listen to me, people of God. There is a mystery which uh, many don't tell you about the prophetic. About the prophetic. We are going to get into the prophetic now. I will prophesy to people. I'm going to speak to people. I'm going to talk to them. But I need to teach you something that will actually change your life. Jane, good morning. Anointed David, 
connecting from South Africa. Good morning, Cindy Speciesi. Um, connecting from South Africa. God, God bless you. Now, listen to me. Many of you have been prophesied to. Many of you have heard uh, about a prophetic word. Patricia, thank you. It's it's okay now. I can hear you. God bless you, Mishek. Uh, you are also here. Um, Mishek, you are saying prophesy, man of God. I am ready. I'm going to do that. Don't worry. Now, 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 now. Sunny, you are saying it's okay now, man of God. Thank you very much, people. As usual, connecting from Allah with that Sopani. God bless you. Listen to me, people of God. Uh, when we look at the prophetic, when we look at the prophetic, many have been prophesied to. But what is more important is when the prophetic word is released and then you see the results or what has been prophesied coming to pass. The moment when you see a prophetic word coming to pass, which means there are things that are involved. There are things that you need to know. <laughs> now, when a prophecy is released, you need to ask your question, that prophecy, is it a now type of prophecy? Is it something that is, I will prophesy, Pamela, don't worry, I'm going to do that, I'm going to prophesy to you, don't worry, I'm going to prophesy to you, Pamela Manguiro, I will prophesy to you now, now, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, I, I, I'll do that, I just want to, to teach you something in these five minutes and then we, we get into the prophetic, now, 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 now. Faith, you are connecting from Nigeria. Now, there are three things that you need to know first in the foundation of a prophetic word. If I am to prophesy to you, number one, you need to find out. If I say to you, you are going to get a job. If I say to you right now, you are going to get a job. Or if I prophesy something into your life now, um, there are things that you need to understand. Is it a now prophecy is it a prophecy that can be activated now is it something that is going to happen now right that's what you need to find out and understand quickly number two when a prophetic word is released you must know um, what to do what to do what is it that i am supposed to do what is it that i am supposed to do i give you a prophecy and i say to you that okay fine you are going to get a job don't sit at home you need to do some action so that the prophetic can be fulfilled. That's why you discover many people are actually encountering a problem because a prophetic word is released and they are doing nothing. There is something that you ought to do when a prophetic word is released to you. Samuel, welcome. Lydia, you're saying any prophetic word for me, Oracle. Uh, Lydia, connecting from Botswana, don't worry. I'm going to uh, prophesy to you right now. I'm going to prophesy to you, Lydia. Don't worry, I'm going to speak to you people. I, I, I've, put, I've actually put your names. I know it's Pamela. I know it's Lydia. I'm going to speak to you. I know many of you. I'm going to talk to you. So, number one, like I said, you need to know, is it a now type of prophecy? Is, is this something that you ought to do? Um, or number three, you have to wait patiently for the prophecy prophetic word to manifest because when the when the word is released it will not fall to the ground unless the lord wants it to fulfill something and remember there is no one who can prophesy without the lord commanding it that is why it's called a prophetic word a prophetic word is a word coming from the lord it's a word coming from above it's not anyone's word that's why I, I, I don't choose what to say when I'm talking to people. I speak to you people at random. So at the end of the day, I'm not sitting down planning what am I going to say. Why? Because a prophetic word, it takes, it takes something. It takes something for it to, to, to happen. The one who is prophesying must have the faith and the one who is receiving must also have the faith. My goodness. I know that David, you're saying I want to know my calling and what should I do. Tomorrow I'll be talking about your calling. Tomorrow I'll be call talking about the gifts. Tomorrow I'll be talking about the gifts in our class. It will be a Zoom session. Um, it will be a Zoom session around later at night. It shall be a Zoom session. I think around four we shall have a Zoom session. So now let's go to this. I'm, I'm about to, to, to engage into some few prayers that we want to pray and then we engage into prophecy. 
the, the things that you need to know, like let's look at Abraham. Let's look at Abraham in the book of Genesis. If you look at the book of Genesis, if you read the story of Abraham, I think it's around Genesis 18. He identified three strangers. He actually identified people that were supposed to come, who were coming into his territory. He identified them. So you need to know how to identify those who are carrying a prophetic word for you. If somebody is carrying a prophetic word that can change your life, you have to have the spirit of discernment to understand and to know them and to identify them. So Abraham identified these three men who were actually going somewhere, but he identified the grace. He identified who they were. I mean, by inviting them, he actually invited. Remember, Jesus said, if you receive a prophet, in a, in, a, in a prophetic name, you will receive the prophetic rewards. If you receive him in the name of a prophet, you receive prophetic rewards. If you receive a prophet in the, in the, in the name of a prophet, you receive the prophetic rewards. So Abraham just welcomed these three and he was not much aware of what was going to take place. He was not anticipating anything from it. He received. Right now you are watching me on, on live stream. As, as you receive what I'm going to be doing to you, something is going to change into your life. It's, it's about you. It's about a choice. It's about the choice that you want to make. It's about a choice that you want to, to, to actually... So you identify. Abraham identified those three people. Right. Number two, what Abraham did was to welcome them. Hmm. Right. Was to welcome them. A prophet will never release a prophetic word if he's not welcomed. Even if he prophesies to you, it will not work because you did not welcome him. What is Apostle Mapanda saying? Abraham identified them and he welcomed them to his house. He begged them to come to his house to say, please come to my house. So at the end of the day, you realize that he invited them to his territory. He drew them closer. The strangers that he did not know, the people that were carrying the grace upon, upon, upon his life. John chapter 1 and verse 12, Jesus said to as many, the Bible says, to as many who have received him, to them he gave the power to become the sons of God, to as many. So in other words, to those who received him, welcoming a prophet, they received something. To as many that received him. To them he gave ye. So in other words, those who received him, he gave them something. To those who received him, he gave them something. It's a prophetic word. You can never receive a prophetic word that will work in your life if you don't receive the prophet that is speaking into your life. You can never receive a prophetic direction if you cannot actually welcome. You. Oh my goodness. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Number one, identify. Number two, welcome. You have got a spirit of discernment. You don't know it, but you have it. You have a spirit of discernment. You have a spirit that can tell you that this is a man of God. This is a servant of God. This is a carrier of grace. And the moment when you identify, you welcome, welcome. You open up your heart. You welcome. Some people are looking and they are watching and they are looking for mistakes. Some people, they are looking, they are watching, they are checking the grammar. Some people are looking, they are watching, they are checking some certain, certain things they want. So they miss, they miss what they are supposed to receive. Remember, Christ himself came to his own and his own did not receive him. And he could not do much because they could not welcome him. They did not welcome him as a prophet. People who were coming from far towns were the ones who were acknowledging what he was carrying. So number three thing, if you want a prophetic word to work in your life, like Abraham did, Abraham gave them food. He actually prepared a buffet for them. He prepared food for them, bread for them, everything for them. So the thing that you need to do is when you identify, you welcome. And when you do that, you, you prepare. You, oh my goodness. 
you you do something the way you are doing it now you are connecting isn't it you are connecting to collect like what you normally say so the moment when i release a word as an as a servant of god that has to work in your life that thing has to work in your life that thing has to work right in your life so abraham gave them food after welcoming them he gave them something Maybe you give somebody your time. Maybe you give somebody something that is valuable to you. And then they did exactly that. After doing that, after giving them food, a, a nice food, then a prophetic word was released. What have you done that deserves a prophetic word? There is something that Abraham did that provoked the, the prophetic word. And the prophetic word came about the wife Sarah and something definitely happened at the right time look at 2nd Kings chapter 4 if you read verse 8 to 10 2nd Kings chapter 4 verse verse 8 to 10 you discover that I'm about to I'm about to get into the prophetic don't worry 2nd Kings chapter 4 verse 8 to 10 Mm. The Bible speaks about this woman. She saw the man of God passing by. She saw this man passing by. As he was passing by, she went to approach this man and begged this man to say, please come and eat bread. Come to my house and eat bread. Mm. Come to my house and eat bread. Listen, after doing that, that is what we were talking about. She wanted to give the man of God something. Mm. She wanted to give the man of God something. Come into my house. I want to give you food. Then, after doing that, she went to the husband and said, I perceive this is a man of God. Identifying. She identified that this is a man of God. She saw this man passing by. And she, she there is something inside of you, child of God, which can unlock the prophetic word to, act, to be activated in your life. There is something inside of you. So, when this woman rushed to the husband and say, husband, no, 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 I perceive or I have identified that this is a holy man of God. What did she do again? You see, this woman was a crazy person, like, like a crazy Christian. She said, okay, no problem. Let's make a little chamber. That's the, that's the third thing that this woman did. Before the prophetic word, nothing, there's nothing that had come to this woman. Hmm. She, she, she didn't, she just perceived that this is a man of God. Now, you see, the error which we do as people of God is we want to hear the, what God is saying. We want, we, we, we don't know how to, 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 to unlock it. We don't know how to, to make it to work. There is something that this woman did. And she said, let us put up a little chamber. Let us build up something for this man of God. And are you away? After they've done all those things, after she has finished all those things, after they've designed everything, built everything, after they've organized all those things, that's when the man of God said, woman, do you need anything? Is there anything to show you that sometimes some people who receive a prophetic word are not those people who are expecting it, are those people who are actually doing something, <laughs> loving God, doing something just for the sake of just doing it. After doing it, this is what happened. The woman said, no, I don't, I don't have any problem. I don't need anything. But there was a man called Gaius. There was a servant of the man of God who was there. He said, no, there's no child here. Hmm. There's no child here. And the, and the man of God said, oh, no problem. Since you have done all this, no, no problem. By this time next year, we shall be celebrating. So it's a prophetic word that was released after it was activated there is something that was done for the prophetic word to be released hmm. apostle mapanda listen i want to pray with you people but listen to me if you discover that there is sin or there is something that is not right it will take time for god to speak you'll be watching but it the prophetic word when it comes it is coming with judgment when something good is happening or already there is something that god is going to do he's going to release a word and something is going to happen that's what you need to know people of god there is no way god cannot speak if people are not doing something if they do good god will speak if they do bad god will speak 
Hmm. Aye. So what makes it not to work? What makes it not to work is number one, people doubt. People start to doubt the God of the vessel that God wants to use. You want somebody who will come in and prophesy to you in the manner and in the way, in the fashion you, you deem necessary. So, so that's why many could not understand Noah because Noah was somebody who was telling them that I can see, I foresee <laughs> trouble coming and they were mocking him because why? He was not the caliber of a prophet they were looking for. It was not the caliber of the men of God they were looking for. So they were taking him as mockery. But they, they failed to understand that this person is directed by God. This person, no matter how he looks like, he is a vessel that God is using. That's why even John the Baptist, when he came in, John the Baptist was undermined. John the Baptist, because maybe because of many things that were taking place around that time, John the Baptist, John the Baptist was looked down upon. But I'm here to tell you something. He was the voice that was crying in the world. He was somebody that was sent before the Messiah, but there were many who were actually even not interested in what John the Baptist was saying hmm. because they doubted. They doubted the, the vessel that God had ordained, the vessel that God, listen, sometimes a prophetic word is lying in the lips of somebody that you cannot expect. Some people are not having titles, but they are carrying the prophetic word. Some people are not even ministers of the gospel, but they are carrying a prophetic word. Number two thing that you need to understand, what makes the prophetic? Even now, I saw somebody in the afternoon, that's why it pushed me here. Somebody in the afternoon was saying, Apostle, I've been prophesied to... Um, and I've been told my testimony is coming, but now my testimony is not yet now. But, and I said in the afternoon, I told you about Abraham and Sarah. After the prophetic word, they were told by God himself that next day, by this time next day, you shall actually be celebrating here. But it did not happen that way. They had to wait many more years. That's why they end up putting Haggai in the equation. Because why? They did not obey the prophetic word. When the prophetic word is released, be relaxed, be patient. It will surely come to pass. Don't doubt the vessel that the Lord has sent to you. Don't even doubt anything. What makes people to be confused is because your situation might not be convenient for change. Some people will look at their situation and say, ah, the man of God is just talking here, but uh, my situation is tough. I mean, my situation cannot change. Now, automatically when you say that, the, the prophetic word will never be made manifest in your life. What is Apostle Mapanda saying? 2 Kings chapter 7. If you read 2 Kings chapter 7, there is a man of God in verse 1 who said, tomorrow by this time there will be cheap things. Things will be bought at a cheap price. Only one man argued with the prophetic because the environment was not actually conducive. The environment was not an environment where things can be cheap. Where? How come? That's why he said, unless your God opens up the uh, the windows of heaven, unless your God do these things, uh, then the man of God said, okay, you shall see it, but you shall not enjoy it. When you push a prophet into a dimension where he now says to you those words, I'm telling you, it won't be right. Why? Because this man, I'm sure he looked at the situation and said, this situation cannot change. You look in your situation, child of God, in your family, you look at your life, you look at your history, you look at everything around you, and you might say things might not change. But I'm here with a prophetic word. I'm going to prophesy to many people right now, and I pray wherever you are, if you believe, you shall see. Don't see to believe. No, 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 no. If you believe, you shall see the glory of the Lord. Some doubt that God can change their story. That is the problem. That's where the problem is. When you hear the prophetic word coming to you right now, as I'm going to pray with you, as I'm going to minister to you right now, when you hear the prophetic word coming to you, believe, believe. Don't look at your pocket. Don't look at your salary. Don't look at the people who hate you. Don't look at the things that are not working well for you. 
Just look at the prophetic word. Stick to the prophetic word. Press on the prophetic word. Put a demand on the anointed voice that has spoken the word. Because something will definitely happen. Because when the prophetic is spoken, there are changes that will take place. I don't know who I'm talking to today because I have to pray. Florence, you're saying exactly. Vivian, you're saying this is too deep. Um... Florence are saying exactly uh, too much doubt. Oh Lord, deliver me from all my sins. Uh, Faith are saying, I believe. Evangelist are saying, prophesy, apostle. I'm going to do that very soon. Don't worry. It's a midnight, it's a midnight prophetic hour every Friday. Uh, memory, uh, you're saying, Lord, open my eyes to discern and believe in your word to see the manifestation of his glory. Yes, uh, Angel Grace, you're saying, I believe I shall see the glory of God in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Now, listen to me, people of God. Um, when, when somebody identifies the vessel that the Lord is sent to and you have welcomed the vessel, you have uh, accepted the vessel, you are opening up doors for the prophetic word that he speaks to work in your life. So if that man speaks a word or if that woman speaks a word, it will definitely happen. Oh my goodness. I think I th this is too deep. I'm going to teach it more on Sunday. This is my teaching on Sunday. I will give more uh, teaching on it on Sunday. And I'm going to do some prophetic de uh, uh, de demonstrations on how this works. Because I want people to understand that the prophetic, for it to be, to be, to be, to be there, something must happen. Something must happen. Something must happen. There must be something that happens. Hmm. There were people who were crying in Israel before Moses was sent to fulfill the prophetic. There was sin that was here in the world and Jesus was released to fulfill the prophetic. So you, you discover there is nothing, there is nothing that can stop the prophetic word from manifesting. If there are too many troubles, if there are too many wars, troubles in your life, Remember, the Spirit of the Lord is about to raise up a standard. I need to pray right now so that I can actually engage with you. I need to speak to you. I need to speak to you people. Um, I'm going to do that. I'm going to even open up the WhatsApp line um, and I put down the line there. Um, as I'm praying, I need to prophesy to people. I need to speak to people. Um, I think you have understood now. Many of you, you now know what uh, the prophetic word is all about. You now know how to activate the prophetic word. You now know how to make it active in your life so that it can actually bring results for you uh, because one thing which I've discovered is somebody can come to you and say ah but I was told these things by a certain prophet I was told these things somebody told me exactly the same thing I'm not that type I'm not that type if I tell you something I want to see results why because I teach you first before I prophesy first second so I have to teach you about how it works. I, I have to teach you and I have to tell you how it works because anything that you are given and you are not given an explanation, it will not work correctly for you. If I give you medication right now and I don't tell you how you must drink the medication, it might affect you. Something that is there to heal somebody might come in to destroy somebody. Hmm. Hi, 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 hi. Keriboni Musebo, we are saying, I received uh, in Jesus' name. Dingiswa Yolong, we are saying, Glory, my apostle, prophesy. Uh, Florence, we are saying, Amen, prophesy, man of God. God bless you. Right, uh, let me just quickly pray. Uh, let's do some prayers. While I'm opening up the line, I need to hit on the prophetic. I'm going to open up the line right now. And I'm going to do that. I don't know what you want me to do. Can I open up the line or can I just go one by one on the list that I'm seeing here of people? Um, the name that I see, I prophesy. Or what must I do? Prophesy without solution is the prophecy without solution is there. Definitely. Thank you. Thank you, anointed David. That's what I'm talking about. Because to me, I normally, anointed David, I normally say prophecy without solution is like witchcraft. Because I, you have been told something. Why did you tell me if there is no solution? I need to have a solution. So these are the steps. These are the steps. So we need to come to a point where when you hear a prophetic word. All right, fine. The one who has spoken the word, did I receive the person? Did I welcome the person? Jesus told his disciples that where you are received, leave your peace. But where you are not received, 
dust the shoes, the, 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 the soles of your feet. Just, just, dust, just put off the dust and go. Which means problems will, will remain there, not peace. So what I'm saying to you is, whenever you are, wherever you are going to be, wherever you are going to be uh, in any environment at any given time, where people are, who are releasing a prophetic word, I want you to be assured that any time a man of God speaks, a prophet speaks, or a woman of God speaks, a prophetess speaks, definitely a change of story will come in. You need to understand that the anointing you respect will definitely work for you. The anointing. I'm not here as a, as a man of God to take advantage of you as a person. No, I don't need to do that. Why? Because if you receive me, you will receive the prophetic rewards. If you don't receive me, it's fine. I don't force you to receive. I will not put threats for somebody to receive. You hear me now? We, it, that's, how, that's why sometimes you can insult them, they keep quiet. You can insult them, they keep quiet. Why? Because they are carriers of certain keys of some people's destinies. That's what I have to say. Hmm. Florence are saying that's the truth men of God prophesy without manifestation is indeed dead. <laughs> Kabele are saying uh, there is written evidence in the way that prophecy has guaranteed testimony. Yes, 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 yes. Um, that's very true, say I hear you. Um, anointed David, you're saying, where are you located, Apostle? I am in Mzanzi. <laughs> Mafatla, you're saying, prophesy, uh, to, uh, prophesy uh, to the name you see. All right, do you want me to go like that? Do you want us to go... Um, do you want to, can I go name by name? Can I go name by, by name? Or can I open, let me open up the line and I can be prophesying also on this line. Father, in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus, I commit your people into your hands. Father, use me as a channel, O oh Lord, to speak life into their life, to speak healing into their lives. Father, at this midnight hour, those who are bound, let them be set free. Father, let them have the understanding that your word will not fall to the ground unless it fulfills that which you have sent it for. Father, I pray right now for your mighty hand to touch their situations. Father, locate their files, locate the root cause of their problems in the name of Jesus. Whatever that is not of God, it shall be uprooted today by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you. Father, we glorify your name for everything that you have done and what you're about to do. We give you honor and glory. We give you all the adoration in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Amen and amen. Right. Um, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's, let me open up. Um, where is the WhatsApp line? Let me open up the WhatsApp line as well so that I can do uh, this one here and um, let me see. Yeah, where is the WhatsApp line? Let me see. Where is the WhatsApp? Yeah, here is the WhatsApp line. Let me open up the WhatsApp line. There it is. Uh, it's open. Let me now go into this now. Who can I start with here? Um, I need to speak to some people. Let, let us do this. Uh, hey, this one is the first caller. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. This one is the first caller. Hello? 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 There's someone trying to connect here. Um, hello? I don't know if this person... Um, all right, let me drop that one. Um, there's someone who's trying to call. Um, the person can try again. Um, the person can try again. Let me see. I don't know why it's not appearing here because it must come out here. Um, hello? Um, let me see. Hello? Uh, I don't know what is happening. Uh, I'm trying to get all of these people now. So these people are trying to phone. I can't. I can't actually... There's somebody on the line now, but I can't, uh, with the 267, with the 26774, 26774, it's a missed call, uh, 26774, uh, hello? Talk to me, hello? Let me open up also the phone line, all right. Uh, all right, it's okay, let me speak to these people right now, let me just, uh, since this one is actually 
taking much time. Let me, because I'm trying to connect to you on. There we go. Uh, God bless you. Good morning. Hello? Good morning. Hello? Uh, now this one is not is not actually going through uh, the person had phoned but now it's not going all right let me speak to Cindy Sway uh, is that Cindy Sway Shazy uh, she's saying prophesy prophesy uh, prophesy to me men of God um, Cindy Sway Cindy Cindy Sway Cindy Sway uh, Shazy I want to speak to you right now there are some things that are happening in your life right now that you seek Hello, good morning. Good morning. God bless you. God bless you. How are you? I'm okay, man of God. Yes, I'm speaking to. You're speaking to Lesero from Botswana. Yes, Lesero. Yes. Um, how can I help you today? I needed a word of prophecy unto my life. Right. Uh, I want my family to be delivered. Lesero. Do you know right now that uh, there are many things that should have been happening in your family right now? But right as 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 I'm seeing it in the realm of the spirit, there is this there is this thing that is happening in your family. There is no unity in that family of yours. That to the extent that if that family is united, there is going to be greater peace and break, greater joy and breakthroughs. Do you hear what I'm saying? Yes, man, of the course. enemy has brought in confusion to the extent that at the end of the day, no one is willing to be helping another in that famine. You hear what I'm saying? That's very true, man of God. Yes, I'm looking at it in the realm of the spirit, but I'm seeing a change because it's a cloud that has been causing those things to happen in your family. That cloud is being shifted as we are talking right now. There must be a change of story Jesus in your name. life. You have been seeing it. There's a dream that you had two days ago. You had a dream that you had two days ago. In that dream, in, yes, man of God. in that dream, it was a weird dream because there were too many people who were gathering at a certain place. Oh, man of God, man of God, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it really scared me, it, and I was stressed after I, I dreamt that. It really scared you. Did you did you tell anybody? Did you tell I anyone just about told the dream? One person. Huh? Yes, I yes, I told one person about it. You only told one person about it. And the person does the person know me? Yes. <laughs> yes, the person knows you. The person knows me. Did the person tell me about the dream? No, 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 no. He didn't discuss it. Well, the person him. knows me on live like here on live stream. Yes, he ah. but he follows you. I see, I see. Now listen to me. One thing that you need to understand is after today, you need to know that there is something greater inside your spirit man. There is something that the Lord has placed inside your spirit man that is going to actually oh. change the rest of your family. You hear what I'm saying? Oh, uh, yeah. Because yes, your prayer, your prayer, your prayer, when I was seeing you, you writing down some prayers that you were doing in January, you wrote some prayers that, Lord, I want my life and my family to be changed. Yes, man of God, that's yeah. very true. Because there are things that you, you, you want to make sure that if it if it happens well, the rest of your family will be okay. Yes, man of God. Because people have been now laughing and they are now saying things. They are speaking. There are too many there are too many people talking what they ever they want about your family. Yes, man of God. Mm. That's very true. Any insult, all yes. those insults, all those insults, all those things that uh, that the enemy is doing is going to change today in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Mm. I receive it. I, 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 I see in the realm of the spirit that after today, listen to me, after today, there are some important calls that are supposed to come to your side, to your phone. There are some things oh, yes, I that you were it. expecting. There were things that you were expecting. They are, they, they, the doors are open for you. Thank you, Jesus. I want to pray for you right now. Is there anyone with you there? Yes, man of God. I want to pray. There's deliverance that is going to take place to you right now. 
Father, in the mighty name of our Lord oh, Jesus. Yeah. I pray right now, whatever that is not of God, to loose it and let it go in the name of Jesus. I speak right now from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. I command whatever that is not of God to come out of your body right now. I command it to loose it and let it go right now. I command it to loose it and let it go right now. Come out of that body. Come out of that body. Come out of that body. Out of that body. Out of that body. Come out of that body. You foul spirit, I command you to loose it and let it go right now. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Come out of that body. Come out of that body. Come out of that body. Loose it and let it go. You strong men, I command you to come out. You strong men, I command you to come out. You strong men, I command you to come out of that body right now. Out. Loose it and let it go. Be free right now in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Lucy, 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 I speak fire from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. Be free right now. Be free right now. Take out everything that you put in that body. Take it out. 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 Take out everything that you have placed in that body. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out right now. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Everything that you've placed in that body, I command you to take it out. Take it out. Lucy. 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 Who are you in that body? 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 I command you to Lucy. Lucy. And let her go. Holy Spirit, touch her from the crown of her head to the soles of her feet. I pray right now, let tongues fill her tongue right now in the name of Jesus. Let your anointing fall upon her right now in the name of Jesus. Be free right now. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. You are free. You are free. You are free. Thank you, Jesus. You are free. You are free. Thank you, Jesus. The old that has been controlling your family, it has lost your family right now in Jesus' mighty name. You are free. You You are free. Come back again with a testimony in Jesus' name. I receive my testimony in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus. Your doors are opened in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Shalom, shalom. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Listen to me, people of God. I see, I see Pamela. Pamela, where is Pamela? I see Pamela. I saw Pamela. Pamela, 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 Pamela. Where is Pamela Manguiro? Come back. Um, God bless you. Good morning. Hello? Hello. Yes, how are you? Hello, sir. God bless you. something else, sir. I'm fine. I'm speaking to. I'm speaking to. I'm a votif lawyer. I'm speaking to. Speaking from Ghana. I'm yeah. a votif lawyer from Ghana. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yes, I'm sir. a votif lawyer from Ghana. It's it's who? I'm a votif lawyer from Ghana, sir. Oh, from Ghana. Yes, yes. How can I open you? Hello? Hello, sir. Talk to me. Hello, sir. Please, I need a prophetic word over my life. You need a prophetic word over your life? Yes, sir. Listen to me. There are things that you, uh, you, 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 are, you, are, you are planning. You are planning. You are busy planning. You, you, you are planning to leave Ghana. You are planning to go. You are planning to move out. You are planning to go somewhere. And uh, it's something that... That is in your mind. It's something that is in your mind that uh, I see in the future that there are many things that are, there are doors, international doors that are going to be opened for you. There are things that the Lord is in store for you. Do you hear what I'm saying? Yes, sir. It's true, sir. I, I, I pray for that, that grace. True. I pray for that grace. I pray for that grace. Everything that you want I in life, it shall come to you with speed in the name of Jesus. What you only need is this prayer, favor, favor, favor upon your life in the name of Jesus Christ. 
what the only the only limitation was that favor because favor that favor is going to open the finances which you need to make it possible in jesus name I receive, it. receive that favor in Jesus' mighty name. That favor is yours in Jesus' name. You are blessed. Amen. God, Amen. God bless you. 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 Shalom. Amen. Um, there. Uh, hello, greetings. Greetings, Apostle. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Uh, thank you so much. You are blessed. I'm speaking to. You are speaking to Tabang from Botswana. Uh, Tabang, yes, Tabang. How, how can I help you today, Tabang? Are you watching? Yeah, are you watching speaking. also online? Yes, I'm watching online, man of God. Ah, oh, Tabang, 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 Tabang. Who are you staying with, Tabang? I'm staying with my parents, but right now I'm with. Uh, my girlfriend, Lisa. You are staying with? With my parents. With your parents? Yes, but right now I visited my girlfriend. You did what? Right now I visited my girlfriend. You visited your girlfriend? Yes, of course. You see... You see, the, 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 there is a, there's a, there are some areas which 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 we want to fix now. You hear what I'm saying? Yes, man, of course. Yes. Um, number one, the you being there, it's 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 an error on its own. Because we were supposed to wait for the opportune time. Because every time, every time you are always feeling guilty and you are always. Uh, feeling something is not right in everything that is happening now especially when it comes to that relationship we need to change it because at the end of the day we can't call god to come in and uh, and, and 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 set us free from certain things in which we are we are moving towards that direct we need to pray we need to come to that point of saying you know what i i now need to uh, live a life that is pleasing to god and the moment when you do that you discover that everything in your life is going to work right now right now are you away are you away you are having some cramps you have some cramps every morning you are away isn't it yes man of god it's a it's a it's a it's a sign to show you that these things that are that that are happening we need to change we need to change this so that everything will work accordingly you hear what i'm saying yes man of god hey, hey. your 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 destiny is all right but don't actually this is the foundation of your destiny and uh, i want you to put everything in order and you discover that if you put your life in order god is going to open up uh, things for you and doors for you in jesus name Uh, when when we have time when we have time when we have time please when you have time tell tell this lady you know what lady um f starting on was going forward uh we want to come to a point where we now pray together not not just sleep together but pray together not even sleeping together let's pray together and let's pray because your future needs prayer you need to pray together yes one of course yeah because because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, we want everything to work well. May the Lord bless you. Yes. Yes, man. Go and change that. Go and change that area and you will see everything will fall into place. Everything will work well. Yes, she's listening, man of God. She's listening. She's listening. Yeah. She, she, she has yeah, to. Yeah, she's following us. She's what? She's following, she's listening to your words, man, of course. Oh, she's listening also, yes. Please do yes. that, the two of you do that, and make sure that you do things the right way. Because right now, you are having problems at home. You are having, you, you are having problems at your home. Because people are saying, yes. because we are not agreeing with people at home there. I hear you, man of God. Yeah, we need to make sure that everyone is okay and everything is right so that we can move forward. 
Yes, man of God. Uh, then, because in, to me, when you come to me and, um, and and you want a prayer, these are the things that I pick first. If we if we sort those things out, first, yes. If we sort those things out, then you discover everything will be all right. Yes, man of God. Mm, that, I hear you. that is where your life is only stuck. Apart from that, you discover everything will move well. I hear you, man of God. God bless you. Thank you so much, Shalom. Okay, Shalom. All right, people of God, I think uh, we are, we are, we are. I don't know why my, my desktop is not answering. Uh, good morning. Good morning, Prophet. God How bless are you, Prophet? You. I'm speaking to? You are speaking to Joyce. I'm calling from Zimbabwe. Ye- yes, uh, yes, Joyce. How, how can I help you, Joyce? I just need a word, prophet, uh, prophet, may you speak into my life. May you give me, uh, I want to get back. My life is as God speaks to me. I need direction. You need direction. Because I'm seeing, yes. I'm seeing, I'm seeing that uh, at this point in time, yeah, definitely there was a lot of, there was a lot of confusion. The problem is this, I want you to gain confidence in yourself. I want you to regain Amen. yourself. If somebody, Amen, if somebody, prophet. if somebody failed in a certain area that you have never tried before, believe in God. You, you are different from the person. You are different from others. You hear what I'm saying? I hear you. Yes, there God, is something, there is something prophet. unique in you. But nowadays, it's like you were, you were now listening more. If people tell you that ah, it cannot happen, you were just listening to those things. Today, yeah. today, as I'm speaking to you right now. The Lord is going yes, to direct perfect. you and the Lord is going to make things to work for you. You hear what I'm saying? Amen. Because perfect. the people that were supposed, the people that, that had promised, many people are just promising. They are not fulfilling their promises. True men of God. It, True. Has to, it has to change because as I was looking at it, I've seen that most of the things, most of the things in your life, most of the things in your life, they need you to come to a point where where we can actually say where we can actually say now are you aware by this time everything in your life was supposed to be okay things were supposed to be better by now yes prophet I but hear you. but but everything just turned i think it's now five years now it's like everything has been going offline the true men of god we need total restoration that. that's the main prayer i'm going to pray for you we need you to be restored Amen, prophet. When that Amen. restoration comes, you are going to see. And and the final thing I wish I want to talk to you about is anything that you are planning right now, from now onwards, please keep it to yourself. Don't don't tell you are a person who likes to, to tell people even your plans. True men of God have spoken. Yes. I'm going to put super glue on your mouth that you are going to do. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, man of God. Thank because you. there are things that are being blocked. Your things are being... That is why... Let me explain it further. That is why yes. you plan well, but your plans are not coming all right. There are things which are affecting your plans. Amen. Help me, prophet. Help me. I saw you and even putting like... money aside for you to do some things, and then you don't even know how that money, where, where it went, what happened. True, man of God, it's true. I've done it on several occasions. Several occasions, but after today, yes. after I've spoken you right to you right now, I pray may God give unto you divine wisdom in the name of Jesus. Let there be wisdom amen. upon your life in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. amen. I thank you, Prophet. I just wanted to hear one last word about my spiritual life, please. I want you to go back. I, I want you to go. Listen to me. The only message I will give you there is I want you to go back to the original you. You hear what I'm saying? I want you to go back to, to the you that that first, that was the first one that was the first love that you were having with God. Amen. Go back Amen. to that. Go back to that you. That you who was who was always like more into the, the, the things of prayer, the things of the way. Go to that point. I, I I have started to retract my steps, man of God. <laughs> I have started to retract. Truly, man of God, I'm speaking from my heart. Wow. I have started to go back. 
Wow. I am always in prayer exactly. and I, I, I have seen it that there is no other way that I can come out Be- besides prayer. Because you were having a, a, a strong relationship with God, a good relationship. I don't know what went wrong, uh, but I want I to think go back. What you have spoken first is like uh, sometimes the confidence inside me because God always shows me a lot of things, especially in my dreams. Hey. And I, yes. So I, 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 I always need someone to assure me, like to give me back that exactly. confidence. Exactly. Yes, man of God, I admit in that area. The Bible, the Bible speaks, the Bible speaks about, um, about David. David, David encouraged himself in the Lord. Oh, yes. Because sometimes we need to look in the mirror and acknowledge what we have done and acknowledge what God is, has used us to do in a particular moment. That's how to carry on. Oh, yes. When people come in and say and, 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 and do that to us, we are not moved because we have already done it on our own in our secret place. Oh yes, it's true. Yes. It's true. Do, it, do it yourself. You. Do you know that you, you, you can check yourself, you can be the one to check yourself to say, you know what, I need to do this, I need to do this. You are the one to check more to give an account to your spiritual life. You are the one who is the best to do that. So you are the one to come to a point of saying whenever you, you can tell yourself, you can even say, like what you have said now, which I have already told you today, you need to retrace back to the original you, to go back to where you were. And then you you said, ah, that's what I'm even doing, retracking and rechecking to say, the the, 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 there are some songs that used to come into your head, gospel songs that you used to sing in your head, like, it was something like your spirit was always happy. <laughs> yes, man of God, it's true. Now, and now, right now, now, as yeah. you, as I, as I started speaking to you, as I started speaking to yes. you, the first thing that I picked up was your heaviness. Yes. It's like you are carrying the whole of Zimbabwe on your shoulders. <laughs> true. It's because people, you know, they, I, I, I take people's problems to be exactly. my problem. Exactly. No, I, I. I, I I, I, I was coming, I was coming to I was coming to that well, area to say that yes, you need what? to you need to if people give you their issues give those issues to God. I always do that. Yes. Man of God, that yeah. is the way that but I'm now, now the problem is myself. to you now it will be like you'll be like yo now that person what will happen? No, as long as you have surrendered it to God, try by all means oh, to, yeah. to 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 move it out of your mind. And I know that God is going to do great and mighty things for you. Amen. I receive. Mm, you are blessed. You are blessed. Continue to continue, continue, continue. Uh, that light, that that light. I need God to revive that light in you. Um, Amen. And 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 I don't Amen. want people to change your character. Uh, I want I want everything oh, yes. to be restored back to normal in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm. Amen. I pray for you right now in the name of Jesus. I cover your life with the precious blood of Jesus. I speak right now in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus. Total restoration right now. Whatever that is not of God in your life, let it be uprooted now in the name of Jesus. I pray right now for progress. Whatever you touch, may it succeed in the name of Jesus. I break all limitations. I break all negative words that have been spoken oh, upon yes. your life. I pray, let oh, blessings yes. flow from the crown of your head oh, to the yes. soles of your feet. When I an receive. enemy comes in one way, let that I enemy receive. flee in seven directions in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. I speak Amen. to the ground, Jesus. the ground that you are in. The ground will not work against you in the name of Jesus. I oh, speak yes. to the oh, air. Yes. The air will not hold any cases that are coming to oh, you in yes. the name of Jesus. Um, every arrow the enemy has directed to you, we command those arrows to return back to sender now in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. God bless Amen. you. You are free and um, go and come back with a testimony. Jesus is Lord. I will. I will, man of God. Thank you so much. Shalom, thank you shalom, shalom. Thank you for your shalom, shalom. shalom. Uh, people of God, um, I think now I need to, we need to, we need to close this line now. Let me close this line quickly. I think we have to close this line. We have to sign out because um, many of you need to go to work. I need just to speak to few people here. Uh, Caleb O'Hile, you are laughing, you are saying, uh, <laughs> I think I need that super glue. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, no problem. I'll send it by courier. Um, I see here, Gloria, Gloria, Gloria Mafatla, you are here. Um, I didn't forget you, Gloria. Uh, it's only that the week has been a bit hectic, but definitely your 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 anointed materials will come to you definitely in Jesus' mighty name. Don't worry. Um, God is in control. Uh, Nene Nosu, you are saying, uh, prophesy upon my life and my deliverance. That is um, memory. Memory Takawarasha, you are saying, uh, prophesy. Uh, on upon my life and my deliverance. Yeah, is that, let me just quickly round up with you people and um, I know that the Lord is going to do mighty things. Right. One thing which which um, one thing which I want you to understand is the Lord that we save, the Lord that we save, the Lord that we save is going to change your life and your family. The main worry was on your kids' memory. Uh, the main worry was like on the children. But I pray right now for a change in, uh, of story in your life in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, and I know that the Lord is going to do mighty things for you in Jesus' mighty name. God is going to change a lot of things. Uh, there's already a turnaround that has already started. And uh, right now, as I'm talking to you, that turnaround is already taking place in Jesus' name. Angel Grace, you're saying amen. Thank you, Jesus. Kabel, you're saying power-pegged prophetic session. Definitely. I connect to my father's anointing, Vivian Moniz. God bless you. Nene Nosu, you are saying prophesy and deliverance. I pray right now, uh, Nene Nosu, that everything that has been held by the enemy, it has been released. If you have listened to the teachings that I was talking about, you realize that these things have already started taking place. There is a change that has already started taking place in your life. I want you to actually appreciate God for all the small changes that have already started happening and you shall see the glory of the Lord in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. You shall see many things happening and uh, like I said, just hold on. God is in control. Just hold on. God is about to do something in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, so don't worry. Um, just keep uh just keep uh keep on praying and i know that the lord is going to bless you indeed and enlarge your territory people of god i'm signing out i've closed the the the, the, the whatsapp line um i've closed this whatsapp line is it still clear? hello how are you prophet by the grace of god i'm fine how are you i'm blessed i'm blessed i'm blessed you are, you are, you are, you are, you are the last i don't know how you enter but <laughs> i'd close the lines but i don't know how you managed to go through I, I was I trying, was to, trying call to call it long, long, long time, long time. Seriously. Seriously. I'm okay. speaking to... I was speaking, speaking to Onad Masike. I'm calling from South, Af South, South Africa, South Africa, but I'm from, from Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Okay. I'm a Zimbabwean. Oh, all right, all right, all right, all right. Yes, how, what, what can I do for you today? Oh, Prophet, oh, I just... I, just, I, I, I in, in December, December I resigned where, where I was working. Yeah. So now so I start my small business, business. like I'm doing like grocer like grocer shop, shop, but I'm using, I'm using my car. car. Mm. So, so uh, I'm, I'm just, just praying, praying for God, God to give me something, something little, little bit bigger, bigger. that I'm gonna like get finance, finance to cater bigger. for myself and for my, for my family, family also. also. Can I tell you something? There was a problem in the area of your from the side of your father's house all men were supposed to struggle they were not supposed to make it in life everyone who have made it in life they go down so now i want that story to change with you there's going to be a change of story and i pray right now that is why you discover now uh, the business that you are, you are you are currently doing the things that you are currently doing they should have, um, you should be you should be seeing the growth there must be some the changes must be happening the only thing that sustained that that business of yours to be still there is because um, god is with you otherwise if you are not with god the business um, could be down i think it's like four times you were thinking of leaving it but there's something that was pushing you to say continue 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 you, I mean, you, I mean, you, were, you were about to say, let me just come out. But this this thing which was saying, continue, it is God who was actually telling you that greater things are coming. I see you. I see you actually going big. I see you growing in that area of your business. I see those things. I think everything around you, like I say, is going to change. Your, 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 main, your main focus of enlarging the business is going to come and it's going to happen. 
Amen. Amen. It, it, it's going to happen. And uh, and let me tell you something. Just Amen. just trust in the Lord. It might look like it's it was slow, but let me tell you something. The time has come. God was Amen. building up something inside of you. Amen, Prophet. Uh, because before God gives you more, he, he actually works on your on your on your character, on your personality, on yourself. He works on you. And then everything will just come, will just come. Amen, Prophet. Mm, everything will just come in. And I, I, I know that God is going to, to do it for you. And um don't worry, just hold on. God is in control. <laughs> Amen, 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 prophet. Amen, prophet. Yes. Why are you staying with the? No, I'm no, staying. I'm staying, staying alone. alone, alone yeah. You are staying alone there now. Yeah. yeah I'm staying when alone. when are you planning to marry? Planning to marry? Uh, I didn't plan because I'm planning to to go back home and to to the house because I was I'm ten years here in South Africa, but I never do anything it at home, and so I. I, my, wish my wish is to, is to do, do something, something at home, home like, like something, something that, that is generating finance. Ah, good. good, good. Thank you. God is going going to do mighty things for you. Let me just pray for you. I want Thank to pray you, for man. your hands right now. Um, Amen. Amen. Every time, every time you start any project, whatever that you want to do, even in, your, in that business that you are in, um, the favor of the Lord must fall upon you. Amen. Father, in the Amen. mighty name of our Lord Jesus, I pray for more grace. I pray for more Amen. anointing. I break every yoke, every generational Amen. yoke that says he cannot make it in life. I command Amen. that yoke to be broken in Jesus' name. I Amen. pray for progress. I speak light into Amen. his life. I pray right now that whatever is planning, Amen. it shall surely come to pass. In his Amen. journey, even if he's going back home, whatever that is planning there, it shall succeed Amen. in the name of Jesus. Any power Amen. that wants to block his blessings, I command that power to be rendered powerless in the name of Amen. Jesus Christ. I speak progress into your life. I speak success in your life in the name of Jesus christ amen and amen amen, amen. amen. that's why that's why that's why i i'm sure it's time for you to 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 uh, it's really time for you to actually even go there and start to do something because it's like i saw last month mostly last month you were having encounters dreaming uh you were seeing in the dream you at home you were seeing yourself more at home yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. thank you for it but I think I, I think now from today, like I said, everything is going to work out well for you by the special grace of God. God is with you. Shalom. Thank you, Prophet. Thank you, Prophet. You are blessed. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you, Prophet. Prophet. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Shalom. Uh Tuso, Tuso, you are saying you forgot to call me today. Tuso. Um Tuso, did did I Oh, you were there in the afternoon? No problem. Uh, the people that I did not phone, um, I will actually get through to them tomorrow. I will try my best. Tomorrow I'm going to be having the class of the gifted. Um, those who are actually gifted, I will be talking to them. The ones who, are, who think they are gifted, I will speak about your gift. If it's a gift, it's your passion, or it's a talent. <laughs> so so I want us to, to separate the three, so that at least when we are talking tomorrow, we will know exactly what we are talking about, and um, by the special grace of God, um, I'll, I'll be I'll be back because I'm going to the uh, to the prayer mountain in the morning, early in the morning, and uh, I think by that time I'll be back. And uh, by the special grace of God, I believe we'll have more time. So may the Lord continue to bless you, men of God. Prophesy upon my career, Theophilus. Uh, but I'm about to finish. I'm about to leave now. All right, let me speak to you, Theophilus. Yeah, your career. I want to speak to you about your career. There are some things that I'm seeing around around your career. There are some issues that have been happening around your career. Um, things are not the way they are supposed to be. Uh, who is this one phoning now? Hello, So, may the Lord bless you. Men of God, prophesy upon my career. Oh my goodness. Uh, but I'm about this one. This one phones me and is listening to me on the other side. And now 
It's like I'm repeating. It's like, <laughs> all right, God bless you, people of God. I'm signing out. I'll see you again. Um, I'll communicate with you tomorrow. Um, by the special grace of God, I'll connect with you in the morning uh, when I'm at the mountain. I'll try to connect to you when I'm at the mountain and I will just speak to you and find out where you are and I'll be praying with you by the special grace of God. I know that the Lord loves you and um, wherever you are, may you stay blessed. Everyone I know that as time, every time you connect, we connect to collect. Every time we connect, we connect to collect. So whatever that you come here looking for, may you collect it. May you receive the things that you wanted. May you get that breakthrough that you are looking for. May you get that deliverance that you are waiting for. May you get that breakthrough that you are waiting for. In the name of Jesus, I pray that your life will never be the same again. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus. So I'm signing out. My name is Apostle Lema Panda. I'll actually see you again in a, in, a, in a wonderful way. Those I did not speak to, those I did not prophesy to, please um, just 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 uh, understand me. I will do that. I will do that. I will do that with you. And um, I know Cindy Sway, Cindy Siwe, Shezi, you are a subscriber. Don't worry. All the subscribers, you will have my number one on one. I will talk to you. All the subscribers. Don't worry, all subscribers, I'm going to do that. Don't worry, don't worry. I will I will talk to you. You are you're on the subscribers hub. So I'm going to, you are the first people that I normally speak want to speak to. So I, I'm going to come there to the subscribers hub and I'm going to drop my, 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 my personal line. Um, then we can actually, I will talk to you people there. I will talk to you, don't worry. I will talk to you. Um, definitely I'll do that uh, by the special grace of God. I think tomorrow I'll put a Zoom link on that subscribers hub. I'll put it there and then you are going to you are going to see it and come to the, uh, what do you call it, and come to the Zoom session. Uh, we will not stream the Zoom session. It's a private session uh, because it's something personal that I will be talking about. Your gift, it's your personal thing. So we can't go public about it. Um, because we don't know who, who might actually be uh, after your, 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 your star. So we, we want to actually hide you and speak to you in the closet. And then you come out and you shine in the light. May the Lord bless you. Father, we thank you. Father, we glorify your name for thy is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen and amen. I'm signing out. So see you again. Um, see you again. Tomorrow, tomorrow I'll connect. I'll connect with you. I think in the morning when I'm at the mountain, and I will just be greeting you as usual. I'll be just greeting you people um, because I know that there are some people who just want to uh, connect. Uh, so God bless you. I'm signing out. Jesus is Lord. Amen. Mm -hmm.